I'm grateful for my time in seminary and as I approach ordination of the priesthood in just a few weeks from now, uh, I really feel about as ready as I could. Uh, you know, as daunting as it is, like we can never be fully ready for the priesthood. Um, I really do feel like our formation here uh, has, has equipped me um, to be a priest, uh, to give my life in, in service of the people of God, um, for love of our Lord. And I think to, just to highlight one, one thing that I've received here, uh, it's to really know who I am and have that security um, that I'm a beloved son of God, first and foremost. Uh, and then from that place of security, I feel uh, ready and, and willing uh, to serve the Lord as a priest. And that's thanks to our formation team here and to people like you. So as I've been reflecting about the this coming end of the seminary formation, I am so grateful for all that I've received that helped me to grow in confidence and joy and this, uh, this new courage to serve the people that without the formation here, I would not have had. Seminary has really been a place where we can walk the path of Jesus Christ and find Jesus on that path and then to know that we're not alone and we're loved and so now as as my class myself approach the end of our time here I mean really now it's our mission to go and help the people of God to walk that path to walk with them growing in holiness to offer them the sacraments and just to intercede for them and really shower them with the Lord's grace and blessing. And just so they know that all of you know that you're loved. And we've experienced that here. I know I've experienced that here. Experiencing God's love, His mercy, and His tenderness. And so personally, I look forward to passing all of that on to the people that I'm gonna serve in ministry. These past five years at the seminary have been uh, foundational for me uh, has helped deepen my own relationship with the Lord through uh, my own spiritual life, through spiritual direction that the seminary provides, uh, but also through the classes that we take, uh, the various theological courses where we learn more about the Lord, learn more about uh, who God is and how He loves us and how He wants us to live uh, in Him and new life in Him. And that's helped deepen within me that own relationship, but also given me that drive and that desire to serve God's people in the church and to help lead them to the same knowledge that they are loved by the Lord and that God has great plans for their lives. And so I'm, I'm looking forward to applying everything that I've, heard, I've learned here at the seminary uh, out in the field, out in the church. Well, as I look back on my entire seminary formation, I'm grateful for how the seminary was this place where I can truly enter into a life of prayer to encounter the love of Jesus, let that love fill my heart and radiate it and share it with others. This has been especially beneficial to me as I minister to the poor, as I minister to the sick, and as I minister to anyone who suffered and was feeling misery in some way. God allowed me to be his minister of mercy, and I'm so grateful for that.